Today, KC Mayor Sly James will make an announcement about the pre-K sales tax to fund an expansion of educational programs. But there has been some pushback with that. 41 Action News reporter Ray Daniel is live this morning talking about that. Ray, we were expecting to hear from the mayor. He gave some strong words on this topic a couple of days ago, and now he's going to go ahead and talk about this this morning, even with pushback coming his way. He is, Taylor, and it should be really interesting to find out what exactly he's going to be talking about because that's what we're wondering right now. He'll be here at Union Station at 945 this morning. He's been talking about this three-eighth sales tax proposal going on the November ballot. This would generate about $30 million a year for pre-K assistance. Now, Mayor James stating 35 percent of kids have quality education options available with 40 percent of the zip codes in the city being pre-K deserts. He wants to change that. But there's been pushback. KCPS, Kansas City Public Schools, released a statement asking to hold off on the sales tax proposal for the November ballot, saying the proposed plan doesn't meet the goal of providing equal access. The CEO of United Inner City Services agrees. While everyone wants early childhood education to be a priority, some are saying there are other options to go about it. And this is a basic right that our children should have, and it shouldn't be require so much fundraising to do what we know is best for kids. Now, the city will vote next week on whether or not this proposal is going to go on the November ballot. Again, Mayor James is going to be here at Union Station at 945 this morning. We'll keep you posted on what he says. Live in Kansas City, Ray Daniel, 41 Action News, today on 38th Spot.